In the last episode we learned how we can manipulate our API and add some fields to it. Specifically we added category fields to it and category names. Then we used Vue.js to display those category names below the titles of our posts. In this episode I'm going to show you how you can very easily create a live filter. So the filter that will in real time filter out our posts based on their titles. Uh, we are not going to be concerning ourselves uh, with uh, stylings, uh, styling of that filter. We are going to do that in another episode. But in this episode, we are just going to create a live filter for the titles of our posts. So in our post list template, I'm just going to create a container right here. That is going to hold our filter. And then I'm going to just edit the title, so H4, and uh, it's going to be filter by name. Okay, and then we have to add an input field. That input field, uh, we will use that input field to filter out our posts. So input, the type is going to be text and the name can stay empty, it doesn't matter for now. Uh, but what we need to do, and this is very important, we need to bind the model to it. So Vue.js has two-way uh, data binding and we have to define that. So vmodel equals and then we name our filter. So now our filter is going to be called name filter because we are uh, filtering our post by name. So name filter. Okay, save that. Of course, if we refresh our page, this of course doesn't do anything right now. Uh, first of all, we have to go into our app.js file and then we have to define the data. So we have to define that filter right here. And to do that, you just do name filter. And that's it. So this could probably work without that, but um, it will give you out a warning in your console. So we don't want that, uh, and it's not <laughs> a lot of work. So you just do name filter, and that's it. Next thing we need to do in this v4, let's call it loop in Vue.js, we have to uh, have some way to say to it, okay, so I want this post to be filtered by something. Uh, specifically, we want to filter it by this name filter that we are going to get from here. So that's the two-way data binding. So whatever we write in this input field, it's going to filter out our posts, actually our post titles. So to do that, we are just going to do a pipe and you do filter by. So filter by and then we have to define uh, what should it filter by. So uh, what kind of input is going to go in here. So this is our model and we just do name filter. Now we can define uh, in what fields do we want this name filter actually by what fields do we want this name filter to filter. So the field that we want to filter out is called title. So we just do by, uh, in title. And I think that should be it. We just save this, go to our page, refresh it. And let's see, this post uh, begins with anim. So let's try this. And I just written ENI and we get this post. You can do something like, let's see, this post has synth in it. As you can see, this works very fast and it's all real time. There is no reloading, there is nothing. So this is where the power of Vue.js lies in this two-way uh, model data binding. So as you can see, we created a filter in, I don't know, maybe a few minutes. 
Okay, so this is it for this episode. In the next episode, we are going to filter our posts by categories. As you will see, it's not hard. It's a little bit more complex than filtering it by name, but uh, this is Vue.js, so it's also pretty simple. Thank you guys for watching. Please like the video if you liked it. Uh, subscribe to the channel if you like the channel. Uh, also remember everything we did here will be available for you on github the link will be in the description below uh, please follow me on facebook or on twitter if you want to get updates on these videos and that's it thank you for watching once again and i'll see you in the next episode